James 4, 17. Therefore, to him that knoweth to do good and doeth it not to him, it is sin. 1 Corinthians 5, 11. But now I'm writing to you not to associate with anyone who bears the name of a brother if he is guilty of sexual immorality, greed, is an idolator, a reviler, a drunkard, or a swindler. Not even to eat with such a one. We have 1 Corinthians 15, 33. Be not deceived. Evil communications corrupt good manners. And then I'll read it in the Amplified for you guys. Do not be deceived. Bad company corrupts good morals. The Bible even goes on to say that, you know, we shouldn't even eat with such people. And it's not talking about the sinners of the world, but the people who are practicing sin in the body of Christ who are calling themselves Christians. Therefore, we are to call out the sin. Um, you know, make sure that you're being led by the Spirit pray and ask God. You actively see somebody sinning. I don't care who it is, a pastor, a, a evangelist, a teacher, whoever it is. People don't want to call out the sin if it's a friend of theirs, if it's somebody who they look to highly with, a, with respect or whatever. But this is an issue. We need to be calling it out. But we need to be led by the Spirit as well because the Holy Spirit will give you the words to say. Um, and it needs to be done with grace and in love. But need to stop overlooking sin we need to stop condoning sin stop saying these things like it's okay for us to be sinners you guys will be held accountable i don't think people understand the depths of being held accountable by the god almighty like like it's time to get it together people stop condoning sin stop saying that i'm a sinner and it's okay the lord knows my heart because the heart is wicked and deceitful okay this is why we must be born again and cursing. I know a lot of people have difficulties in cursing. Um, we should not be cursing. I know it's difficult for some, especially if you've been cursing for so long. But just go into prayer and ask God for deliverance for cursing. Because I literally had to go through um, a little deliverance um, for cursing. And I have not cursed since. And this was last year. When, I first, when, when God first took it from me, I would be like cringing every time somebody cursed. But yes, we should um, we should watch what comes out of our mouths because we have babes that are watching. We have the enemy who is watching. And we have all these things that we need to be very mindful of. And we need to be taking back to the Father. Everything should be changing when you are born again.